Hey there, amazing people. I'm thrilled to have you here today. Welcome, curious minds, to our video that explores the ins and outs of Mermaid Got Married. Mermaid Got Married is a 1994 Hong Kong romantic comedy fantasy film directed by Norman Law, starring Ikin Cheng, Christy Chung and Takeshi Kunishiro. Based on the 1984 American film Splash, the plot involves a mermaid who travels onto land and falls in love with a human man. With our foundation established, it's time to explore plot and its relevance to our overarching theme. In the opening scene, a young boy named Chi is on a boat with his mother and her boyfriend. He falls overboard and almost drowns because he cannot swim. However, he ends up on a beach and claims that he was rescued by a big fish. Years later, Shi Ikin Cheng has grown up but still has a fear of water due to the accident. He has become a teacher and obtains a new job at a local high school. Students are drawn to him because of his youth and good looks. Despite his attempt to be professional, he is aggressively flirted with by Kiki Teresa Mack, a popular girl who has the nickname Princess. This makes Kenji Takeshi Konishiro, Kiki's on-again off-again boyfriend, jealous. One day Chi brings his class on a field trip to the docks. During an altercation he is pushed into the water, sinks and loses consciousness. He is rescued by an orange-tailed mermaid Christy Chung, who takes him to shore. She is the same mermaid that rescued him when they were young, and due to this second meeting believes they were destined to meet. She releases a magic pearl from her stomach, which she uses to revive a still unconscious Chi. She is interrupted when people approach and flees in a panic. She accidentally swallows the pearl and wakes up, thinking that he was merely swept to shore by the water. The mermaid attempts to swim home, but discovers that she can't without her pearl. She decides to find Chi, knowing that she can pass as human with legs as long as she doesn't get wet. The mermaid tracks Chi down to his school, and there she is mistaken for a worker's niece, named Si Mei. She is befriended by Kiki and attends the school as a student. Although Si Mei can walk on legs, she must bathe every so often to recharge. One of these sessions takes place in the girl's bathroom, and her large tail is accidentally seen by Miss Yuan Kingdom Yuan, a teacher, who faints in shock. Siyumei's secret is also discovered by Kenji, who promises to help keep her hidden, and the two becomes friends. After this encounter, Miss Yuan becomes obsessed with finding and catching this big fish, enlisting the school's principal Kent Cheng and other friends to her cause. Siyumei and she spend time together and become close. She discovers he can swim now, which is due to the pearl in his stomach. He and Siyumei swim together in the school pool with Chi agreeing to be blindfolded when Siyumei claims she doesn't have a bathing suit. Siyumei decides that the best way to get her pearl back is to kiss him. After a dinner date together eating clams, Siyumei gets the chance, but she is so caught up with her new feelings for Chi that she forgets to summon the pearl. On Kai's birthday, he confesses that he has feelings for her, and Siyumei protests that he can't because she is a fish. Si Mei stands under the rain and allows herself to transform into her mermaid shape. She falls down in shock, and at that moment Miss Yuan and her colleagues run in and capture Si Mei, carrying her away. She, Kenji and Kiki work together to rescue Si Mei where she is being imprisoned in the principal's swimming pool. They are successful, and they return to the docks the next morning. Si Mei has her pearl now and can return home. She and Si Mei declare their love for each other, and Chi adds that he'll wait for her. Si Mei jumps into the sea, transforms, and swims away. Afterward, Miss Yuan, the principal, and the rest of the group follow Chi around in the hopes of finding Si Mei again. One day, Chi bumps into a bridesmaid at a wedding, who looks identical to Si Mei. The principal takes a hose from a nearby gardener and starts spraying the new girl but she doesn't transform into a mermaid, much to their confusion. The grown-ups are then chased off by Kenji and Kiki. The new girl doesn't appear to remember Chi, but when he invites her to eat clams she gets excited and lets slip that she is, indeed, Siyumei. The pair embrace while Kenji and Kiki watch. 
Now let's shift our focus to cast and embark on an intellectual exploration of its various dimensions. The King Cheng as Qi, a young teacher at a high school, he was saved from drowning twice by a mermaid and eventually falls in love with her. Christy Chung as Si Mei, a mermaid who can obtain legs while on dry land, who eventually falls in love with Qi. Takeshi Konishiro as Kenji, a high school student who befriends Si Mei. Teresa Mack as Princess Kiki, a high school student who befriends Si Mei. Kent Cheng as Principal, the principal of the high school. Kingdom Yuan as Miss Yuan, a teacher at the high school. Lao Si Ming as Uncle Lao, a janitor general worker at the high school who mistakes the mermaid for his real niece, Si Mei. Dennis Chan as Officer Chan, a friend of Miss Yuan and the principal whom works together with them to capture the mermaid. Elaine Law Sud Ling as Fatty, Kiki's best friend. Roselia Fun Wai Hang as Kai's mother. Get ready to immerse yourself in the world of soundtrack as we examine its impact and relevance. Fei Wong performed two songs for the film Angle the main theme, played during Chi and Si Mei's swimming pool scene and during the end credits, Sky played while Chi walks sadly on the shore after Si Mei leaves. These songs are released in Fei Wong's 1994 album Sky. In the upcoming section, we'll be dissecting reception and exploring its implications in greater detail. Far East Films said, to see such an enjoyable romantic comedy as Splash be remade into a somewhat anomic Hong Kong feature does little to inspire. I love interacting with my viewers, so leave me a comment and I'll do my best to respond.